uh, Ricky is one of the great Washington inventions. An intoxicating invention that has turned a bit of American history into a bartending competition. It, it's got started around 1900 uh, at, a, at a place called Shoemakers, a bar that everybody called Shoes. Named after Colonel Joe Ricky, who was a Washington lobbyist in the late 1800s. And uh, it was originally um, whiskey, uh, half of a lime squeezed into a glass, and some club soda on ice. And it became a huge sensation, first in Washington and then over the whole country. An old-fashioned cocktail with a modern-day twist, as eight local bartenders compete here at the Bourbon Bar in Adams Morgan to see who can make the best Ricky in the city. I've created a black pepper gin Ricky. Mine is a um, berry lime Ricky. Instead of gin, as I do ginger. But will the judges like this modern take on Washington's oldest indigenous cocktail? What I'm looking for in any cocktail, not only a Ricky, is complete balance. What I'm looking for in a Ricky is what it was originally meant for in Washington, which was to be a refreshing drink in the blistering summers. The winner for me is the bartender who manages to encapsulate the very heart and soul of what a real Ricky is about. It really adds their own flair and creativity through the flavor combinations that they choose. And there's many variations of the Ricky, like this one, the DuPont, which is made from honey and ginger, and this one, the Georgie, which is made from some type of cherry concoction. And the winner is of both the judges award and the drinker's choice the black pepper ricky can you believe it i can't believe you can't believe the black pepper one it's delicious i'm i i'm actually flummoxed that uh that i won both these that was, that was a big shock to me no shocker to the judges though who awarded justin with not a trophy not a gift certificate but simply 15 extra minutes at the bar to make his black pepper ricky for the crowd in Northwest Washington, I'm Marquette Smith, WTOPnews.com.